Opening day is always something. You, know, you never know what's going to go down opening day. I thought our team played uh, strong, hard, uh, pretty clean game. Uh, not a tremendous amount of mistakes in that game. A couple of early penalties cost us in the red zone. Uh, a fair amount of field position and possibly some points. But on offense, we had over 500 yards of offense. We rushed for over 238 yards. We held them to somewhere around the neighborhood of 50 yards rushing. Uh, I haven't seen all the stats yet, but uh, uh, possession time, we had 42 minutes to their 17. That might be as big as you could possibly have. So we possessed the ball for 42 minutes. They possessed it for 17. Um, so that was a heck of a deal. We only had one turnover. We were 9 of 17 on, on, on third down and two of three fourth down conversions. So I thought, uh, all in all, I was uh, you know, pleased with opening day. Now put that as what it is. It's opening day. We got a lot of work to do. We play a really good Pittsburgh team coming in here. I thought UMass, I thought Mark uh, Whipple and his staff did a great job. You can see the improvement on their football team. And, uh, you know, and, and, and uh, that, that was evident to me. And uh, so I, I think they have good things to come. Um, you know, we were, you know, in this game, on this day, we were, we were very, you know, we were physical. We were, you know, it was hard to defend us in the run game. And, uh, and on defense, we made some great plays. Highlights of the game to me. You know, we're at halftime. We had rushed for 211 yards at halftime. We had run over 50 plays at halftime. I don't know. I think we must have had close to 100. I don't even know, 90 plays, maybe somewhere in that neighborhood. Um, we uh, on defense, we they on a Turner sudden change situation. We stopped them on sudden change. We had an interception on defense, and uh, we held them to seven points. One big chunk play is really all they had. So. I thought both sides contributed. Uh, we played two field goal, two kickers, and both of them did a pretty good job. We, we missed the one sh uh, uh, field goal, but uh, I'm all in all, out of the box, a lot of young guys entered the game. You know, we're in an atmosphere, and now we get to go home, uh, play on national TV against Pittsburgh on Friday night, and uh, you know, just try to get better. Just try to each week improve. The biggest growth in your football team is in the first three weeks. And uh, so I feel like we took a positive step, but we got to continue to grow because this time of year, if you don't, uh, last year we grew each week. We got to grow each week. Now we're playing a really good team coming up here, and that'll that'll be for another day. But we're playing a really really good football team. So you know we've got to elevate our play, and uh, we've got to look for explosives. We're a real strong, physical kind of move the ball down the field team. But I'd like to see if we can create more big yardage explosives. Which I really feel like, you know, that's something we got to. We have some weapons now to do that. We've got to start going to that a little bit more, probably a little bit more down the field vertical game, which we'll, you know, take our shots at. But in, for the first game, we want to come out here and we want to give everybody a chance. I thought Ryan and Donnie did a great job. They managed a, a young football team today and, and they brought us to where we needed to be. So that's a very wordy, long deal, and I'm about done. So go ahead. Steve, uh, in a game where both teams featured transfers at quarterback, yeah. how did you feel Tyler held up his end in terms of managing this young team? And I was extremely, extremely, uh, we were extremely proud and excited about Tyler today. He managed the game like a, like a veteran big time player and uh, didn't get rattled on the pick and just was a leader, uh, was strong, had a great look in his eye. I mean, he really managed the game. Even down at the end, he didn't try to force it. He, Took off with the ball so we could kick that field goal to go to bring us up to, I think at that time it was 30. And uh, that was really intelligent. He knew it. He came over and said, Coach, I didn't want to force it, blah, blah, blah. You know, that was, it was, uh, his growth today was great. You know, he's still, even though he's an older guy, he hasn't played a tremendous amount of snaps now. I mean, he's got a few games under his belt in his career. So his growth will be great.